Hi guys, it's Courtney. Welcome back to my channel. We are doing another plan with me and my B6 Traveler's Notebook. And this is a look back at last week in this with this gorgeous kit from Jackson Pepper. Like I'm just, I love the way that this turned out. Um, yeah, but we are moving on. And we are planning for the week of March 12th through the 18th, I think it said. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. I am using another printable kit from Planning Choco. Um, I believe this was called Honeybee. And um, as usual, I will have it linked down below. I am starting with the date covers per usual. I um, was kind of all over the place with the kit that I wanted to use this week. I ended up using this one because I um, used this clip art um, for my daughter's baby shower invitations and we had her baby shower on the 10th. So I was still kind of feeling it. So I went ahead and used it for this week. It's so weird, not like weird, but it's such a drastic change. Like when you use a photograph kit and then you go back into using clip art. Like I, I loved last week. I think it's one of my most favorite spreads I've ever done. Um, but I also love this week too, but they just have two really different, um, they just feel very different, so. And I think I discovered last week that doing this sidebar before I dive into the week really um, helped me. Although my sidebar is very crooked at the top, so um, yeah. We're just gonna pretend that it's not. <laughs> So I'm just going in with a glitter header and my habit trackers for the week. And I love this. It's not really a yellow. It's more, and the camera's not really picking it up. It's more of like a, but it's not really like a neon green either. I don't know what, it's like a chartreuse, I guess, is the color that I'm looking for. Um, and I, I think that's just a really cool accent color. And then I'm going in with the weekly ombre for my dinners. Um, I'm going across with glitter headers. And then this week, last week I did um, like three heart checklists at the bottom of every day. And I really liked having that space um, to just put, you know, daily to do's in. Um, and so I'm doing it again this week, but I'm moving them to the top of each day. And I don't know, I think I prefer them at the bottom looking back, but it's fine. And then there was, a, so there were three boxes that kind of made a scene. Um, 
and I was trying to figure out like how I wanted to lay them down and I think that kind of threw me off because it um, meant that I had to like dedicate that chunk of space um, three days in a row and I tend to stagger my boxes I just like them that way so I'm not sure if I loved the effect of that but um, it is what it is. I am glad that I kept the scene together, however, if that makes sense. Um, that little YouTube character sticker is a printable from, um, I love to print. And I'm just putting a little thing down with a scale so I remember to weigh in today because I'm actually doing this voiceover on Monday. I think I'm going to staple my inserts after using printed inserts that's the one thing that I do like about them is that you you have one like self-contained book um, or bound book I guess is what I'm trying to say <laughs> And then I am putting pencils down on Tuesday and Thursday for Rowan's uh, morning at school. And then another YouTube character sticker for a video that I hope to have up on Wednesday. And then I am going back and putting the butt first coffee sticker from the kit. And I was trying to work the cup in, but it just, it looked too crowded or something. I don't know. And I'm just using that half box on Tuesday to mark off or to signal to myself that I need, you know, I'm going to spend that chunk of time um, working on YouTube stuff while Rowan is at school. And we don't really have a ton of stuff planned this week. Uh, my daughter is still here from Virginia, and I wasn't sure, like, if she wanted to, you know, do anything or hang out. So I didn't really make any plans for this week. She's um, not leaving until Thursday. And then we typically don't make plans for the weekend until about midweek. So and then I'm just putting down the weekend banner from the kit over glitter headers. And I think I just wanted to get that down. I, I kind of skipped around a lot this week just because I didn't have a lot of um, like concrete plans. So I was a bit at a loss. And yeah, I'm putting another half box down on Thursday um, for doing... Um, blog or YouTube.
or YouTube stuff. Um, and then the, that work sticker and that get stuff done sticker are both from Paper and Gumption. And then I have the school script stickers layered over the pencils. Those are from the Planner Shack. Um, and that those film and edit script stickers are from the Planner Shack as well. <laughs> And then Wednesday night, instead of putting down a bunch of TV little things, because I have, I don't even know how many shows come on on Wednesday. I just use a half box and wrote in um, all the shows. And then I'm going to find a TV sticker, but I guess I don't do that until later. Um, and then I'm putting in a quarter box with the little Instagram icon from the kit to remind myself to post mid my midweek spread, which I'm terrible at doing, but I remain optimistic that I will get better at Instagram. Um, and then we will go to a story time on Monday. Um, so I have that script sticker from Beautiful Planning and I was looking for something to layer it over. Um, so I just got a quarter box from the kit. <laughs> and then Saturday morning, um, Rowan has his first, um, like, outside friend birthday party. Um, one of the little girls in his preschool class has a birthday. And then um, his preschool has dad, like a, a dad's night at the little golf place by the school. Um, so yeah, there's that. And then I just have the full box at the bottom. Even though I hate bees, I find them like graphically very interesting. Um, and I know that like bees are needed and the whole like destruction of the honeybees and all of that, but I'm not a huge fan of bees, um, except like art, bee art. <laughs> I don't know, that's weird. <laughs> and um, then I'm going to put down one of the appointment labels to layer um, a sticker over. So obviously I was looking for grocery stickers uh, to mark going to the grocery store on Saturday, although we'll probably have to go before then because we don't have a ton of food in the house right now. And I do have some packages coming this week, so that is a Happy Mail sticker from the kit. Um, that I'm just going to layer over um, a glitter header and I think I just end up writing it in. So I have a new Traveler's Notebook coming, um, washi from Simply Gilded, and a kit from Shop Jessica Hearts. And then that glitter scallop label is from Planning Choco. I bought a bunch of like functional items um, a couple weeks back and I think I am probably looking for yeah that's like a mommy and me sticker from ooh, Harriet Wright designs I think but I'm not sure what we'll do on Friday but we'll do something um, so I just wanted to put that little character down to remind myself to plan something um, and then I have a quarter box and a bow from Paper Crown Planner um, to mark a blog post on Tuesday. 
um, which I will be posting about my daughter's baby shower. So if you're interested in seeing that, I will uh, link my blog below, although this video will go up before the blog post if you watch it like the day that I post it. But anyway, I'll link my blog down below. And then I um, put down some shows on Sunday night, although I needed one more because the arrangement um, starts again on Sunday and I want to remember to watch that show because it is so good. Um, and then I put the last full box to cover up. I think it says like happy thought or something and a glitter header. Um, and I'm just going to use some of the deco like in that little white space there. And I think I use a piece of washi and then a glitter header and I'm just going to label, label, layer um, a script sticker that says gratitude over it. Um, I did that last week and I really liked just being able to um, jot down um, some thoughts about the week um, in that little space. So, So I'm trying to figure out um, that little priorities box I've been using to keep track of my um, YouTube and Instagram stats. And so I'm just trying to figure out like how I want to cover up the fact that it says priorities. Um, I was going to use a piece of washi and then I didn't really love the way that it looked or washi from the kit, I should say. So then I end up just... Um, cutting a piece of washi from a roll that I had from Michael's and then I'm going to layer another one of those scallop um, glitter labels on top of it and just write it in. And then next to the work to do, I have a little like woman working on her laptop and that is from Paper and Gumption as well. It was like a $2 Tuesday. Um, and then I would think I flipped back to see like how much space I left myself the last week. Um, and I did like the pattern on the bottom washi so I wanted to use that. And the paper that I use to print on is non-removable, like, um, waterproof mat. So it's very sticky and I was having trouble, like, pulling it up once I cut it. And I got this like rose gold floral um, washi tape in my paper panda box and I really love it. So I layered that over the washi that came with the kit. And then this is the final spread. My card was full and I didn't know that my camera cut off, but I really love the way that this turned out and I'm getting okay with there being like white space on the the last page um but yeah it's really different from last week but I like it almost as much but as I last really week like the way um, that this turned out um and 
it gives me plenty of space to fill in as I go throughout the week. I have my Wacky Holidays down at the bottom and all of the other stickers that I added I will have listed in the down bar below. Um, but yeah, I'm pleased with the end result. Um, so thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button to see more videos from me. And I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.